Is this thing on? Check, check. <laughs> Hello, welcome or welcome back to Yoga with Paige. I'm obviously on a slight little walk right now. It's just freezing inside. So for this introduction, I wanted to take you with me outdoors. Don't worry. We will next be inside and I'll be trying on all of these different brands for you, which is the topic of our video today. So thank you for tuning in. If you are interested in an honest review of some of these top name brands, Aloe Yoga, Gymshark, Jed North, some of these brands I really, really, truly like and will proudly endorse. And some of them, I don't understand the hype. So if you're interested to see which brands I truly love, and I am all about quality, about it staying up, about it fulfilling its purpose. I feel like, and I live in these yoga clothes. I live in them. I go to the gym in them. I, where I do yoga all day, every day for you in them. I would go to work in some of them because I don't want to mess up my good yoga clothes, you know, but I go to the store in them. I go everywhere. Point being, I live in these clothes. So if the quality stands up, if the seams aren't ripping, if the elastic isn't loosening, then I am here to fully support them, especially the smaller companies, the no name brands. Sometimes I just feel like the big name brands don't deserve the hype. So if you are interested in an honest, honest review, which companies I kind of endorse, which ones I just love to practice in, which sets make me feel the best, make me like want to walk out into the world saying, hey, y'all, look at me, then stick around, especially ladies, this is for you. I know matching sets are awesome, and I'll show you some matching sets. I'll show you some little pieces that I've stuck around, kind of collected over the years, which ones I love and why, how they fit, how they've held up over the past five years of owning them. I don't really shop that often, so a lot of these pieces I've had for at least a year. So if this interests you, stick around, stay tuned. I'm on my way back to my house right now where we're going to try them all on. We're going to get to talking through them all and you can help decide for yourself what your next purchase will be with what brand and why and hopefully have a more informed decision that will make working out or just your athleisure lifestyle a little bit more convenient and sustainable and better for you. And I'm not sponsored by any of these brands, but I do have a few discount codes. If you're interested in some of the ones I talk about, you can find them in the description below. If you want to purchase through that and use money to save for yourself. Hello, hello. You are in the Yoga with Paige studio room. Welcome. And I am using my front camera so I can actually see what I'm giving you here. So hopefully the quality is good enough. And I'm just going to be holding my microphone because there's no way I'm clipping this onto every single outfit because I did not realize how many yoga clothes I have, uh, how many sets I have and how many clothes I wear. So first things first, we are diving into Silverwind, the brand Silverwind. It's not a big brand, but it is one that I wear probably the most often. To be honest, it is one of my favorite brands and it, we have a little discount code here for you below. I'll let you know which, which, uh, brands I have discount codes for you for, so you can save a little money on your next purchase. So our first one, da -da -da -da, Silverwind, this brand has actually really surprised me. It has very much surprised me. I really, really love obviously the keyhole detailing right here, the little ruche this gives you a little bit of a fullness look okay the back is super cute as well and this mesh I don't know if you guys sweat as much as I do but this mesh really helps me to breathe and eliminate some of the sweating but what I love the most this was the color that I got first <laughs> yes I mean first because I bought another one I loved this set so much it stays up for one. It stays up. It has it has seams in the front. It has seams. So you have to watch out a little bit for this area. But it has pockets, girls. It has pockets. Okay. So it stays up. It's basically the full length of my leg. 
And I never really have to fuss and muss with it that much, especially if you practice with me here, you will probably notice a few different clothing items that I pull out today. I have to fuss with more. This is not one of them. And I loved it so much. I rebought it in another color about two months later. So I will show you that right now. And here we have it, ladies and gents, the same set in another striking color. Okay. And ladies, this one holds you in, holds you nice and tight. Okay. They're lifted. They're secure. All right. I know I don't have the biggest chest in the world, but makes them look good and it holds them in. You're not worried about anything flopping around, slipping around. I do so much cardio in this set. It's unbelievable. I loved it so much. And I also have bikinis from there. They also do have a swimwear collection. I won't show you it on this video because this is a activewear yoga try on haul, but they do have amazing swimwear as well, which you can obviously use the same coat on. So let me, let me show you. So let me show you my third set. So this is set number two or three, depending on if you count a color change as a separate set, but it is one of my favorites. The only qualm I have about this superhero looking set, okay, you can see the super cool pattern here. I don't have my legs even, I guess, but the super cool pattern and the amazing back, like I do not have a single other top like this. I think it's stunning. The only thing for me personally is I am a messy girl, so I don't do well with white. I have had to spot treat <laughs> this part and this part, the knee. I even have a little stain at the moment right here on the knee, but I am now noticing that I will have to spot treat. But that is my only qualm about this set is that it's white and I'm just a messy girl. So that's the only negative thing I even have to say. I am a small, I'm wearing a small in all three of these sets and their sizing seems to be pretty true. They are very, very stretchy. I honestly love the way they fit. This one I do toy with a little bit more just because of the, this part. I don't know what you call that. The, um, I don't know boobage. I do kind of tend to pull it up, but I think it's more of an insecurity um, thing. It's not really, it doesn't fall down. Like I have no slips or anything like that. It's just kind of more of like a, Ooh, I'm not used to the style sort of a thing, but I think it makes you look like a freaking superhero. Like I'm about to kick somebody's butt. So <laughs> I love silver wind. I love everything. So I just ran <sighs> Excuse my out of breathiness. I just ran downstairs to grab the little scrunchies that came with my sets. Okay, so this one came with, was it the blue or the green one? I can't quite remember at this point in time, but it came with this cute scrunchie. This one, I believe, came with the bathing suit. 95% sure it came with the bathing suit that I own and that I love. And I'm literally about to order another bathing suit from them because I just, I gravitate towards it every time. I'm like, oh, I want to wear that bathing suit. But they also gave me um, a garment bag, like a huge, huge, huge garment bag that you can put your sports bras, your regular bras, your leggings, your things that are more delicate in the wash to put them all in so they don't get jostled around as much with everything else. And I use that bag every single time to wash my clothes. I used to have another one. I actually have two other ones, but I love this one so much. They come in a nice sustainable bag. Their, their whole thing is about sustainability and creating clothing and artifacts with sustainable resources. So I just honestly love everything about them. Excuse my out of breathness at the moment right now. Um, but I do, I love this company. I endorse it. I just love it. I love the way that their stuff makes me feel. I love the compliments I get in them. And I love that they stay put. This has not stretched out. None of their waistbands have stretched out. That's been a problem for me in the past. Things will stay up for a little bit. And then as you wear them for a few hours, they start to fall down. But these just stay. They just suck you right in. So highly recommend this brand. And we will head to the next. 
We are now on to brand number two, which is a very, very popular brand in the yoga community, especially. And I just really don't care for it. To be honest, I don't really care. Um, it's Aloe Yoga. I just feel like for the price, for the price of their products, I'm not sold. I'm not sold. I actually won most of these clothes for free. I think I will show you another little top. It's basically the same thing as this one. It just doesn't have the little ruching, the little ruching detail here. So it's not as flattering. But I think I paid $20, maybe $30 for this pair of leggings, this whole pair of leggings, and then two little black tops. Like I said, the other one is very similar to this. So their leggings are priced at $100 or more. And then this top was, I think, at least 60 or 70 bucks. 60 or $70. And I know it's a low support. Okay, I know. I read the labels. I read the description. It does say low support. I just, I don't know. It just doesn't do much. Like, it doesn't do much for the price. Like, it's cute. Don't get me wrong. It's not bad. I don't hate it. I wear it often if you <laughs> practice with me here on my channel. And I do wear these pants. I will say, I think I got these in an extra small based on their sizing because I did get different pants first. I got like, I wanted to try those flare pants that were kind of going in style at the time. And they just looked super, super wonky on me. So I was like, oof, I'm gonna return these and get a pair of leggings. And I really, really enjoy this color. I really love the blue color. I think they're a little bit tight. They kind of, I kind of pull them down so that I don't get a little uh, mischief in here, but they're just not my favorite. They're not the ones that I reach for, like a comfort pair of pants. You know, ladies, you know what those are, your comfort pair of leggings. And also for an extra small, they are so long, like they are so long, they could literally fit over my heel, which is, I, I find that quite weird for an extra small, but it's not that I have anything bad for this company. Their customer service is amazing. Their, you know, their shipping and everything was timely. It was great. I just, I guess I'm not in love with the products and I don't understand everybody's obsession with them. I don't get it. They're not that great. You could spend a fraction of the price on something and literally get it similar to this. I don't know. Is this that amazing? I really just, I don't think so. It's not quite grabbing me, you feel? I'll show you the other top really, really quick. It's about the same thing. And here we have it, folks. Like I said, it's basically the same top without the rouging. I know, I think I got some deodorant on it. Don't mind me, I'm a freaking mess. But it's the same style in the back. Yes, okay, the fabric is pretty nice, but it's not like a velvety soft that I would pay an extra $50 for. That is just my opinion. Please don't like come at me saying that oh, you ordered the wrong size or oh order different colors eh. i've looked at the website multiple times and it made me actually not want to participate in some challenges because i was like eh, i would honestly rather win a different company's clothes on popular opinion i guess but there you have it folks real authentic honest yeah this awkward scrunching down here just like isn't for me like why do i need to have so many scrunches that you need to fix. But there was one thing I forgot to mention, and it was the fact that I wore these pants. Like I said, I wear all of these clothes everywhere. So we went from the gym out to our healthy spot breakfast at Tiffany's. We love you, Tiffany's, our little omelet that we usually split, our little egg white omelet. And I got potatoes that day. I splurged for a side of potatoes. So I was going to put some ketchup with my potatoes, and I opened the ketchup. Boom, got a big old stain right on the top of my leggings. You probably can't really see it, but I got a huge stain right here. And honestly, I wasn't that mad. I was not that mad. If it was another pair of pants, I would have cried. But this one, I was like, eh, all right. If it doesn't come out, whatever. They're not my favorite pair of pants. And that's all I'm gonna say. I'm just gonna leave it at that. Not my favorite. All right, so this third brand that I'm going to show you is CQ Fitness. So it's one of those really, really small brands. It's not a big name brand. It might even be one of those brands that stays for three years and then 
this appears. Um, but I honestly really enjoy it. I have enjoyed the products that I've gotten so far. There were some kind of discrepancies. We will revisit those in a second here. But I will say the sets are not cotton. They're not um, like a really, really, they're a different kind of material. Okay, so they're all polyester. They're all nylon. So they're a little bit thicker. They're a little bit thicker material. But, and they're a very basic design, kind of an open back, at least this set that I have. But it stays. It's comfortable. I feel like I can move around in it. I've gotten multiple compliments on this. People have actually stopped me at the gym asking where I got this set. So I don't know if I just, if it just like looks like it's comfortable, if it like looks good. But I feel good in it when I wear it. I wear it all the time. Um, don't know if it's technically squat proof. Uh, I don't really know. I think it is. I hope so. I'm kind of looking in my own mirror over here and I've tested it out before I went to the gym, but I feel like, you know, as you wear it and you wash it and you wear it and you wash it, it might become a little bit more see-through. So it's not the best quality around. I'll say that right now. It's not the best quality, but for the price that it is, I think it's pretty dang good. Yeah. <laughs> um, my mom liked it so much. She got a set or two in it. One of my friends had got a set or two in it and they would wear them as they were doing yoga and stuff. So it's honestly just a very comfortable set. If you're looking for comfort, I would recommend CQ Fitness, Charles Quality Fitness. Um, it's, it's pretty, it's pretty comfortable. I've had this set for about three. Oh, wow. Yeah. Two or three years now. And I wear it quite often, so it is durable. It has held up. I do have a little discount code for you if you want to purchase one of your own. And then I also have something else to say about this company, though, here in a second. So my question for you, CQ Fitness, is why are your sizes a little bit inconsistent? That is my only thing with this company. I actually liked that blue set so much and felt so comfortable in it that I bought another size or another set, but it's in the same size and it just doesn't, it just doesn't fit the same. Like the straps are just loose. There's more gappage everywhere. The pants fit about the same. It's the top that really just did me dirty. I don't understand it. I actually find these tops so comfortable that I wear them to work because I have work shirts that are kind of open in the back here and I wear these bras to work so I wear them for like an eight or nine hour shift and they're so comfortable but my only qualm with this is the sizing might be a little bit inconsistent depending on I don't know what color you get or like when you place your order because it's just a little funky to me you know, it's like when you buy something and you love it so much that you buy it in three other colors and none of them ever fit the same from the first one, which we will revisit later. All right. This brand is worth the hype. Gymshark, I have been wearing since before I even started yoga, before I was on YouTube. So this dates back to five, six years ago when I was just going to the gym, when I was just getting like athleisure workout clothes for the sake of comfort. Now I took the padding out of this top. Um, it does come with padding. I took them out. So I know it looks a little uniboob-ish, but that's just my own personal preference for what I use it for. But this top I love so much. Look how unique it is. Look at her. Look at her. Look at her. Take it all in. Look at her glory. She is so unique. She fits so well. <clears throat> she just hugs everything right in. And I just honestly love the little straps. I love it. This is a high intensity workout top. Also, the pants. I literally paid somebody to fix these for me because I, I'm kind of a klutz. Okay, so I may have good yoga balance, but I don't have good real life balance. I don't know if that's like depth perception or what it is, but I'm constantly knocking into walls and I know where they're tripping over my own feet, like just stupid crap like that. So I did fall down one time and I wrecked this little part in my leg and you can't really see it now. I was wearing these clothes 
while I was practicing, especially here on YouTube for months with just that little hole in there before it started getting bigger and bigger. But I love these pants so much. I could not throw them away. So I got them tailored. They just feel so buttery soft. Like it's one of those pants that makes you just want to like feel yourself. Like you just want to like run your hand up and down your leg and like get a little of your own action. If you want that, these pants are for you. Now, I'm not a shopping girly, so I'm not one of those people who knows like, oh, yeah, from XYZ collection and this person, I don't even know, created it. This person sewed it together. I, I really don't know. I will put the links of the brands and stuff in the description and feel free to comment and ask me. I will try to look them up and go in my history. Um, I'm, I know I have an account, so I can definitely look those up. I will try to put them in the description as much as possible for you. But if you have any questions, feel free to comment, message me on any of my socials to find out more information because these pants are to die for. And I know they're old, so I'm honestly not even sure if they sell them anymore. But Gymshark is a very good brand. I do love them, even though they're very popular. It almost makes me not want to like them because they're so popular, but they're more worth it in my opinion. And I actually had the exact same pants in a green color and I ripped them so badly. They were beyond repair because the rip was like real big in the knee. There's no way that you can like color patch that enough to make it not anyway. So I had a literal funeral for these pants a few months ago. And every time I look at the matching bra that I'm about to put on right now, I just die a little inside. So let's check out the next little fit and some of my other favorites. So here she is. Here was the green sports bra that matched those exact pants that I just had on in this nice, beautiful green color that I ruined. RIP. But Still love the sports bra, still wear it all the time. Cute little like open detail right here. It's not a keyhole because it's not in the front. I don't know if you still call it a keyhole. I'm not a fashionista, but <clears throat> you will see me wearing shorts so often. I live in Florida, people. Most of the year, it is 80 degrees, 90 degrees, feels like 112 with the humidity. There's no way I'm wearing yoga pants all day, every day without some shorts thrown in, okay? These were my favorite, favorite shorts. I don't know what possessed me to get them in white. I would, as I was telling you earlier, I'm not a white girly, I can't do white, but these have withstood the test of time. These have gone through the ringer. They actually have, they actually have uh, <laughs> a little oils, some sort of oil stain right here that I can't seem to get out. Obviously, you can see another spot or two. Listen, these are worth it. I will wear them. I will wear them. The stains will keep coming. I will keep wearing them because I love them so. Which brings me to my next point because those were small and so were these and they do not fit the same. People, why are you doing this to us? They're great. I love these shorts. They're in black. They go with everything way better for me. I can't spill on them as much, but they don't fit. This. They are tighter on the bottom cuff. They roll up all the time. Like if I move a decent amount, let me just do some weird, funky moves over here. See, they're already kind of rolling up. They're already bunching and they roll. They end up rolling like this. And then I'm constantly having to pull them down, which I don't really understand because the white ones don't do that to me. The white ones don't do it. But do I still wear these uh, almost every day? Yes. Do I wear them for yoga? Yes. Do I wear them to the gym? Yes. Do I wear them to work? Yes, I do. <laughs> I wear them almost every day. I love them, even though they still, you know, you kind of constantly have to like pull them down, do one of those. Not really about that, but I do love the shorts. So also, I just want to say I do like this company. I do think they put out quality products and yes, they are a little bit higher in the budget, but they're not like extravagantly so for crappy things. All right, my fellow clothes wearers, are you ready to see a brand that you might not have ever even heard of? 
<laughs> Jed North. <laughs> I honestly did not realize how much I must love this brand because I didn't realize how many articles of my normal yoga clothing wearing repertoire <laughs> are from this company, Jed North. They have this cute little logo here. I don't know what this is or what this symbolizes. Uh, also not sponsored, but I love the way that they make me feel. This one, I definitely pull up all the time. She's constantly shifting around. The padding in here does not stay well. Um, I don't know if it's just because of the size of my small chest or what, but it is super cute. I only really wear it when I know that I won't be making any extravagant moves where I move my arm like this, because as you can see, it just starts to kind of move down every time I do that. But it is very, very adorable, and I do enjoy wearing it. These shorts I wear all the freaking time. All the time. Um, they are getting a little bit small on me. Everything I wear is basically a small. I don't know if that's a character flaw or what, but I buy smalls. Just I look at the charts, and I just seem to be a small. These are getting a little small on me. I'm not sure if it's because I've had them for years. And over the wash and the wear and the tear, they become a little bit smaller, or if I'm getting a little bit bigger. But either way, still one of my faves, always come back to one of the staples in my wardrobe. So let's see all the other pieces that I have. I have some sets that I'm that are actual sets together. I have some sets that I tried to kind of match, you know, when you're trying to like match different pieces with the colors and they're like a little off, but they kind of work together. And then I just have some random stuff. So here we go. All right, so here she is, my favorite bra ever. I wear this one so much underneath my clothes to work. Look at the freaking back. How beautiful is that? I find it so amazing, but it still lifts you up and gives you support. And like I said, all these pieces I have had for years. I have washed it so many times, dried it out in the sun, and she's still holding up strong. I love it. I think, I think originally I meant to get these and like I said, try to pair them as a set. I think I have a little stain right there. Don't mind that. Um, also have a stain right here. Just, I am just a stain prone person, but I, you probably can see right now. I can see it looking at myself in this front facing camera. These colors don't exactly match because they were not an actual set together. I just try to make them a set together. But I will say, I do like these pants. I even like them better than the aloe yoga pants. And look at this little detail. This little foot stirrup. How adorable is that? How adorable. This is the only pair of pants that I have right now that have a little foot stirrup like that. So if you're in the market for these, highly recommend. Also, not sponsored. I just like their clothing. So this was a set that I got from them. Obviously, it is the exact same print. They are meant to be sold together. I usually wear a bra underneath this, but for the sake of time, we're not going to put on another bra because I didn't realize how many outfits I had to share with you today. So these pants are, again, one of my absolute freaking favorites. These were another one that I had to send off to get hemmed. They ripped <laughs> in the seam. Um, as we grow, I think I definitely need to start getting some mediums. These are feeling quite tight on me right now, but I love the way that these look and they don't really show a lot of sweat. I usually go for darker colors or fabrics that I know kind of wick sweat in that they're kind of like sweat, uh, resistant or whatever you call them. But the camouflage also helps to camouflage your sweat patterns because I remember um, at the beginning of my YouTube career, someone actually told me, oh, remember in that one video? Yeah, don't ever wear those clothes again because you looked like you had sweat patches all over you. And I said, don't ever wear those clothes again. I will wear them every day. Thank you so much for the advice. It was not warranted or wanted, but thank you so much for your opinion. Anyway, I don't think they look like sweat patches at all. I think it looks clearly like camouflage. They fit like a glove, and I love wearing these pants. These are another one of my go-tos. Like I said, I literally took them to the tailors to get them fixed when they ripped. So 
I love Jed North. We still have another two sets and a few different tops. Side note, I love how disheveled my hair has become throughout this whole try-on process. <laughs> but this is a recent purchase from Judd North. Again, I just love their leggings and everything. These are a little bit short, but I love the little crisscross in the front. It really kind of gives you a nice little slim waistline look. And then I got this top to match as well. I mix and match these. I love the material. Everything about it, Judd North, chef's kiss. And then here we have a little standalone top that I think just speaks for itself. She's a little cutie. She's a little bra. She's a little top at the same time. So you can mix and match. You can layer with her. You can switch her around just like I do. And then here we have it. Uh, another top that I bought years ago. I will say this one looks good, but she doesn't feel good. She does not feel good. I don't wear this one that often. Um, I'm always situating it. I think this one that I got, honestly, is a little bit asymmetrical because if you look in the middle, the middle seam is way on the side. Like these are even. Middle seam way on the side, so not constructed well. The straps, the straps leave marks and lines on my neck, on my back, everywhere. They kind of just tug and pull. They're also very thin. I'm honestly surprised that they have not like broken yet. They're just a very thin, I don't know, a piece of string. That's what it feels like. I feel like I have dental floss just on my shoulders, like grating over my collarbone. So that's what this top feels like. I don't want to dissuade anyone from buying it because it's not like the worst thing I've ever put on my body in the world, but it's also not the most comfortable. If you're trying to have a comfortable day, you don't want to put this one on, at least for me. Other ladies may have different perspectives. I have seen somebody else wearing this top. I don't know. It just, it looks good, but she don't feel that good. All right, and now we have it. We have come to the last set of the day. Drum roll, please. Woo. We love this one. This one is an all-time fave. I use this as either a sports bra or as a shirt by itself. We love this extra little detail. So if you wear a tank top over it, usually your tank top kind of fits right around here. So you get this cute little crisscross in the front. It's just kind of a normal razor back on the back. And then I did get these pants. Um, they don't exactly match. They're not a set, but I did try to match my colors well enough. And a lot of times I do wear them together. They're very smooth. They're like butter. They're a very nice, smooth, silky feel. So, you know, we just like her. We like a good skin tone set. We like some neutrals. Hmm. I have nothing bad to say about this one, honestly. I have had this for years. And I still love her. We're still going strong together. All right, my good friends. After all of that changing nonsense, I just wanted to hop into something comfy here. This comfy little fleece. This is not a part of the try-on haul. I just wanted to say that if you liked any of these brands that I said that I had a discount code for, they will be shared down below. Please feel free to comment or message me on any of my socials with any further questions or sizes, anything like that. Like I said, I'm not a fashionista, so I'm probably not the best at linking these things. But if you have any questions, feel free to reach out. I just wanted to give you an honest review, an honest opinion of the clothes that I wear the most often. If you've been practicing with me here for a while, you have seen these outfits again and again and again, mix matched around all of it. So I wanted you to know what I honestly think of these brands, of these products, and what sizes I wear if you, maybe that hopefully helps you in your next purchase decision. And maybe we can even help each other and you have a little discount for yourself. So that was really my whole goal for this, a little try on yoga clothing haul, help you with your next future purchase and give you some more insight into the background of all of this. Also, it gave me a great workout trying on all of these clothes. So thank you. <laughs> and it was a nice little trip down memory lane. 
give this video a thumbs up if you found any of this entertaining or if you liked any of these pieces enough to go shop for yourself. Make sure you hit that subscribe button if you're not already. Subscribe to Yoga with Paige where we do everyday yoga flows, yoga talks, different mindfulness meditation practices because yoga is a way of life. It's not just yoga on the mat. And I look forward to the next time I see you. Thank you again for tuning in to just my opinions. Have a great rest of your day.